Taurus, what's up? Welcome to my channel. Am I tripping or nah, Tarot? My name is Cock Frost, but you could call me the Ghetto Nun. I'm here to do your December love reading from the 1st through the 15th. Please keep in mind that this may or may not resonate with every bull, okay, in Italy, okay? It just won't. So if it doesn't, check other signs in your chart, check other videos, or come back and check me out later, okay? Just so you know, I start all of my cards out upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting in reversals because that is some bullshit, okay? Tell a friend, that's some bullshit, okay? I pre-shuffle um, before I start so I can lay down my first question and get a gist of what's going on, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. So I pulled the Three of Cups for you, the Devil, the Seven of Wands, which was clarified with the Death card, the Star, and the Three of Pentacles. So my question was, what does this person think about Taurus? Um, off top, you could be dealing with the Water Sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Scorpio for sure. I see Capricorn out here, Aquarius, uh, Earth Sign, Aquarius, uh, I mean, sorry, Earth Sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Fire. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, right? Off the top, there is a third-party situation going zone. Like, there is, there's two people in a relationship. Actually, there's three motherfuckers in a relationship, right? Because there's a third-party situation going on. Somebody knows about this third party, and they are done. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know if this is still uh, stemming off from the last reading. Like, that love and hip-hop shit. Like, that's what was going on, this love and hip-hop shit. But the difference is, well, no, because even that time, they still wanted to fix it. So the person with the third party here, with this three of pentacles and this three of cups, they want to fix this relationship with you, Taurus. And I have a feeling you're not having it, Taurus, or vice versa. They're not having it or you're not having it. Um, but they want to fix it. But this devil is here. Let me put one of my chair on my chetties because this is like a repeat offender type shit. You know what I mean? Like... I feel like this person is always fucking around with somebody else. You know what I mean? Like, always. Let's see. Message of concern. Remember, you got this last time, right? Damn, that sure is the motherfucker with the mushroom belt and the mushroom jacket. Like, she's looking at a picture like, I can't believe this motherfucker, right? I use that to clarify the devil. So, like I said, somebody already knows that somebody is a fucking hoe basically you know what i mean and they are not having this shit anymore this is what this person is thinking either you or them taurus i'm fucking done i'm not having this shit this is like dead you know what i mean put some fucking embalming fluid in this fucking relationship because it's fucking dead right but the other person is like no i want to fix this shit like no it amazes me how people fuck up and then they're all determined to want to fix some shit. Like, but you keep fucking up. Like, whoever this is, Taurus, this has happened more than once. Either you or them have taken this person back before and y'all, you've heard the same shit. Heard it all before, right? Same shit. Let's see how they see you, Taurus. How's this person see Taurus? I think this is the same person from the last reading tour is just still begging to come fix some shit with you. But they still on that bullshit. I feel like they're still messing around. You know what I mean? I really do. Like, they may be back to apologize, but I feel like they're still on that punk shit. So this is how they see you, Taurus. The sun and the four of cups. So far, I'm going to get another card, but this, this is how they see you, right? Like I said, could be dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. I see Leo out here with the sun. this person see Taurus six of swords like I said you are you or somebody Taurus is like fuck your apology like this shit is unforgivable but now they know like the sun rises and sets with you you know what I mean but you're not having it Taurus you're not like this person came to apologize they're constantly coming to apologize but you see right through their bullshit it's like you keep apologizing for the same shit over and over and over again I feel like this is you, like you found out some shit, and I feel like this is them sending you a message of to be like, I'm sorry, blah, 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 blah. And you like, boom, did you put that shit on airplane mode? Did you <laughs> did you block them? Did you block them, Taurus? Because it looks like, like you are really done with this shit. Like, Taurus is the bull. Like, once their mind is made up, ain't no changing that shit. Like, this, <laughs> this motherfucker could talk to their face turn blue, right? It's just no... It's, it's just no forgiving this shit. I really feel like like that last reading I did. It's somebody messing around with somebody that the other person knows. Like they either work with this person or 
they're friends of the family or they are a family or some shit like that. But somebody messing around with somebody that the both of you know. And that's some unforgivable shit is what I'm picking up on, Taurus. Is how they see you or you see them. Let's put one of these four cups. Queen of Pentacles. Right? Let's, I'm going to put another one. But usually the Queen of Pentacles is in a relationship. You know what I mean? With the King of Pentacles. This is a mom. This is like, like I said. Like, you know what I mean? Like, this is... A family person this is like somebody that like was really once upon a time really working on a relationship with somebody you know what I mean until they went out and stuck they thank thing and somebody else so now this Queen of Pentacles is like I don't want your fucking apology I have a feeling Taurus either you or them like you're not even being rude about it like you just kind of keep it to yourself like just leave me the fuck alone like just do your thing you did your thing it's cool I'm out like, I feel like it's not even a fight anymore, Taurus. Like, you just kind of quietly slipped out. You know what I mean? Like, let's put one on this Six of Swords with my Tarot Marchetti. I don't feel like you're causing any drama, like, Taurus. You just kind of checked out mentally, emotionally, and physically. That's commendable. You know, some people like to cause a ruckus when they leave. Damn, this bad health been flying out for everybody. Yeah, so you leave it a fucked up situation. You talk, Maybe this shit is making you sick. You know, stress makes you sick, Taurus. It can. It gives you headaches. It can make you skinny, make you fat, make you have a heart attack, a stroke, all that shit. So maybe you got real sick dealing with this person. Maybe, or you're just sick of their shit, Taurus. You know what I mean? This really looks like the same shit. Same third party, same bullshit. You done left this motherfucker. Now they whining and shit, wanting you to come home. But this time is different, Taurus, because it looks like you, like I said, heard it all before. Like, I've heard this shit. It's fucking Groundhog Day every time this motherfucker talk because it's the same old shit, right? Let's see how they feel about you, Taurus. Or you them, Taurus. You're either doing this to them or they're doing this to you. Seven of Swords, okay? This is the lion cheating, stealing whack-ass motherfucker you know what i'm saying like either you see them like this or they or i'm sorry either you feel like this about them taurus or they feel this way about you but like i said now the three of cups the three of pentacles is out here the seven of swords like i said the devil the third this is a third party situation a motherfucker that's not changing a zebra cannot change his stripes and a cheetah cannot change his spots and that's what somebody's thinking like I just keep getting, I've heard all this shit before. I've heard it before. Four of Swords came out with this Seven of Swords. Definitely could be an air sign up in here, right? Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Let's put another one out here. They feel, somebody feels like the other one is, has, Elvis has left the fucking building, basically. Like, that's all that keeps coming out. Look, Eight of Wands reversed. There is no forward movement. Taurus, you have given the fuck up. Or this person has given the fuck up on this whole relationship. Like, like I said, Elvis has left the building. Like, there is nothing. Let's put one on the Seven of Swords. I want to know what the fuck they doing. Whatever this is, I, I really keep picking up on, like, somebody's up with somebody's, like, family member or co-worker or best friend or something. And somebody's like, this is some unforgivable shit. False person came up to clarify that seven of swords, right? There's somebody in the background. This is just a lying motherfucker, but I feel like this man in the background, I feel like this is somebody that was around you, Taurus, that was sleeping with your spouse. Like, I'm just going to keep it so 100. They wore a false mask. Your spouse wore a false mask and the person they were fucking with wore a false Like, these are two people that would hang around you knowing that they were fucking around and would still hang out with you type shit. These some old, like, ratchet-ass motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like, either you or them, Taurus, but somebody is just a fucking... Ugh. Like, they just... They just a foul-ass motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? But they still want to come back and apologize. But like I said, you like, fuck that. I keep hearing this shit over and over, and you keep making me feel like this and shit. I just feel like this person has you stressed the fuck out, Taurus, or has stressed you out in the past, and you are like, done. Done with this shit. Let's do uh, Four of Swords, Eight of Wands. Again, could be a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I'm picking up air hella strong, though, in this reading. Like, this could be an air sign, Taurus. One more. Mm. 
Nine of Pentacles. Like I said, somebody's leaving. I think, look, looky here, looky here, okay? Basically, to wrap all this shit up, somebody has had a fucking enough with somebody's bullshit. Somebody is a repeat offender in this motherfucker. They constantly dip out. They constantly are caught fucking around with other people, right? Constantly. It's not, this isn't a first time thing. This is constant. But this time, they fucked around with somebody that's like off limits type shit. Like somebody, like I said, could have slept with a family member, a sister, a best friend, a brother, some shit like that. And that shit was unforgivable. Like this. Somebody does not want this apology. Like, this shit is over, O-V-A in this bitch, right? Because, I mean, it was just, I mean, it's one thing, you know what I mean? To mess around with just somebody like, I don't know. You know what I mean? It's one thing for that. But to mess around with somebody that you both know, and then to sit up in a motherfucker's face and smile in their face, like, that's what was going on here. That's what I'm seeing. They're smiling in your face all the time. They want to take your place. Backstabbers. Like, that's what I'm seeing here. This is cold blooded shit. Let me put one on this four of swords and this eight of wands reverse and this nine of pentacles. Basically, somebody's leaving to go be single. This is a single person who can get shit on their own, right? Which makes sense why this person was leaving. You know what I mean? This queen of pentacles did not want to hear that fucking groundhog day ass apology, right? They've heard it before. So now they're like, well, fuck it. I'll just do my own motherfucking thing. Like... Mm. Four of Swords, Eight of Wands, Reverse, Nine of Pentacles. Give me one card for that, please. Wow, Taurus. It's really, it seems like it stems off from the last reading, though. But now you're like, just left. Like, whoever this is, dipped out like a lady. You know what I mean? Or dipped out like a gentleman. Like, you didn't cause a ruckus. You just... Simply packed up your shit, closed the case on the piano, and walked the fuck out. Like, that's commendable. I, I admire that about you. So this uh, occupation came out to clarify the Four of Swords, the Eight of Wands Reverse, and the Nine of Pentacles. It's like, I can do this shit on my own. This lady is working. Damn, look at her fucking arms and shit. That's a buff-ass bra, right? This person is like, I'm strong enough to get this shit on my own. I'm tired of dealing with this spouse. You know what I mean? That keeps fucking around. This shit is dead. Do not fucking call me anymore. Fucking airplane mode on that ass. You know what I mean? You went airplane mode on that ass, Taurus. I ain't mad at you at all. <laughs> I mean, let's let's look at this person, though. Because this person, I'm going to put a card on here. But this person that wants to come and fix it, the person that's constantly cheating and fucking around, right? This is them. They still want to come and fix this shit with you, right? Like the nerve of this motherfucker, though, right? Did you take them back times before? I think you did. And now, so now they're used to it and they just expected you to just fall back in line, Taurus. Like, oh, no, nah, he or she'll just take me back. Like, they got real used to doing that bullshit, probably because you gave them chance after chance after chance, right? Tauruses are real nice. They're bullheaded, but they're real nice people until you just wear red in the, in the bull ring. You know what I'm saying? Put some red on and keep throwing darts at that damn bull. Eventually that bull is going to charge at that ass. You know? Let's put one on this uh, star in this three of pentacles. Uh-oh, that flew out. I'm not going to take it because I don't know which way it flew. One on this star in three of pentacles, please. Poverty. So... I don't know. Did you leave this person at home or maybe they had to leave Taurus? Maybe you kept the house and shit and told that motherfucker to get out. So now they like this, sleeping at their friend's house in the car and shit. You know what I mean? Shit like that. Like, is that why the fuck they want to come home? You know, they depended on you so much. That's what I'm saying. Like, you took them back after all the bullshit they did. And so they kind of got used to that shit and just never thought that you would ever, like, stand up for yourself, Taurus. They never did. Let's put one on three of cups. Three of cups. This is still this person. They see you as go. <laughs> I like saying that. Three of cups. Let's see here. Marriage. <laughs> I told you, like, they want to fix this shit, Taurus. They do. They do want to fix this with you or you them. This could be totally you towards them, Taurus. You could have been the motherfucker out there. You know what I'm saying? Deuce Bigelow, Mel Gigolo all up in this bitch. It could have been you or it could have been the spouse. Put it where it's supposed to go. But whoever the person is that was constantly fucking up, 
is trying to come back home. Or, yeah, trying to come back home. I feel like, Taurus, maybe you kick this person out. You know what I mean? That's why if it is a marriage, somebody had to get the fuck up out the house and now somebody wants to come home. The only thing is find out where the fuck they've been staying when you put their ass out. Like, were you staying with this with this person, with this third party? You know what I'm saying? Is this where you were staying when I put your ass out and then shit didn't work out with them? Now you want to come back home? Like, let me know some shit, you know? Watch their ass, Taurus. I don't blame you at all for putting this person out if this is a repeat thing and they keep making you fucking feel like this and shit. You know what I mean? Like, hell yeah, leave. Or make they ass leave, one or the other. But uh, like I said, you went airplane mode on that ass. And I am not mad at that at all. At all, Taurus. So, that's been your reading. Keep your head up. You know what I'm saying? Stay strong. Stay resistant to this shit because you are right. You know what I mean? I'm sure it's probably hard and this person's probably tugging at your heartstrings and shit and all that shit saying all the right shit. But if you know this is some shit that they constantly fucking do, stay strong. You know what I mean? Stay strong on this shit because you deserve better, Taurus, period. Point blank. Ain't no ifs, ands, buts about this shit, okay? Anyway, Taurus, that has been your reading for December the 1st through the 15th. Like I said, this may or may not have resonated with every single Taurus in the world, okay? But I still thank you so, so much for tuning into my channel and visiting me and saying what up, okay? This has been... Oh, yeah, I just said that. Damn, third. This has been your reading. Okay, so anyway, my name is Cog Frost, the Ghetto Nun. Thank you for visiting. Am I tripping or not, nah, Tarot? I will talk to y'all later, okay? Love ya. Bye.